How's everyone doing? I'm trying to do a uh, review of Boxy. Um, a lot of you people may not have, may not know that uh, not only can you buy a Boxy box, but you can also download and install the uh, Boxy um, interface on Linux and Windows. So this is what happens when you, uh, first thing that happens is you got to sign up for Boxy and do all that good stuff, and then um, uh, once you launch it, you sign in, and we're going to go to TV shows real quick. I'm not going to play anything. I don't want to violate anything like that, so browse the TV show library. Sounds good. And it's going to show basically what's available um, to watch online. You could do a little Naruto Shippuden. Now, this isn't all the series. This is what it, like, all the seasons and, and all the, uh, you know, the, um, you know every single episode on Naruto Shippuden, but it's you know what's available for free via websites like YouTube and Crunchyroll and things like that. Now to go back, you're like, oh, how do I go back? I just press Escape. Um, I'm sure I could right click or something else. If you had like a clicker remote, that would that would work pretty good too. Um, I'm gonna head over here, just the arrow keys on my keyboard, and just kind of navigate down. Uh, so we got Epic Meal Time and Sanctuary. Here's Blue Mountain State. If you want a little half nudity action going on, there's season two, all of that. Season one, all of that. So that's pretty good. I've got all of there, that going on. Um, American Pickers, Vampire Diaries. I mean, so it's it's got quite a bit available um, to watch. Um, so. Ultimate Fighter Heavyweights. I mean, let's see what they've got uh, free from there. Look, Season 13. Finale. Uh, season 12. This is fantastic for me. I mean, I love UFC. I've been watching UFC since it came out in, uh, oh, I think it was 93 when the first UFC came out. Aftermath. This is great stuff. So, I mean, and when you select one, like I said, I'm not going to play it. Spike TV, ad supported. So some of them have ads, some don't. Um, so this is good stuff. There's Chris, uh, there's uh, Lieberman. Yeah, Lieberman. Um, I think before uh, before he became famous. So, and once again, you know, I just hit escape and I go back. So I'm going to go back again. And um, it's going to ask me, well, where do you want to go here? Uh Sorry, it's kind of jumping around. There we go. Let's go to movies. I want to see what free movies are available. Let me just, let me see the uh, movie library. So I, I don't have anything in my... I don't keep a lot of files on my hard drive. Um, so I want to see, you know, what free stuff's out there to watch. Now, once again, it's scrolling the internet. It's trying to find what's available for free. You know, there's Big Buck Bunny. Um, you know, there's a lot of a lot of documentaries available. Uh, right now, it's in, it's in the process of scanning, so I can't really click on anything. So, there we go. Initiation, death of his mother, visits his father, lose lonesome Australia, da 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 da. You know, um, strangest dream. Anthropology students point to nature of prostitution is drawn deeper into profession than she ever expected. You know, this is um, this is all stuff from like YouTube that's pretty much for free. Um, a lot of it's rated B flicks, you know what I mean, orthodox stance, that's probably, yeah, ooh, that's, I don't probably watch, it's a boxer, eh, boxing films, I love boxing films, so you get a lot of, a lot of good stuff, uh, movies you may not have seen anywhere else, um, I think I saw, there it is, Final Fantasy, Advent Children, you know, um, so there's some mainstream films, uh, a lot of this stuff is, I'm sorry, that's triple threat, that's NR, so probably, uh, probably some boobs in that one, um, but, uh, you know, there's uh, probably a lot of, like, B-rated flicks that you may not have seen, um, looks like a lot of it is also, you know, older films and Beautiful Truth documentaries, uh, most of the stuff you'll see on Netflix, uh, if you are installing this on a Windows machine, um, you can run Netflix directly through there. Unfortunately, if you're selling it on Linux like I am, 
because uh, Netflix uses Silverlight, um, you won't be able to access Netflix. So, but I've got a you know PS3, so it's not all that bad. And here's some of the album art and stuff that I have with, you know, that the, it, it was able to get with uh, the music that I currently have. So here's like there's Boba Flex, Blink 182, Big and Rich, you know, Buck Cherry, Chevelle, all the good stuff in my collection. Michael Jackson. Gotta have Michael Jackson, you know. Primus, R.E.M., Revis, Saya. I mean, this is all the stuff I have and all all the things it was able to grab. So, um, I think it's fantastic too. So, this would be, I mean, if, so for those of you wanting to create the true media center experience at home, and there's um, apps like Pandora and things like that. Let me get more into the apps. You got the Flickr app. Boxy Browser, uh, Revision 3, I think is a, it's a television thing, Funny or Die, Pandora for, for listening to internet radio. I mean, this could help you really make um, your entertainment PC, in my opinion. So, Escape Again, Escape Again, we'll go home. And I'm going to, I'm just navigating here with just a keyboard, uh, arrow keys, and still able to do what I need to do and we're gonna go ahead and exit boxy so there I've exited um, let me pull it up on opera so you can see which which um, and installing is pretty easy with um, with Linux you just right click and open up with uh, so you got the Apple Macintosh you can install it on your Macs guys you can install it on Windows machines Windows 7 uh, Apple TV um, and you could use if you have an iPod Touch or an iPhone, you could use that as a, a remote control if you guys are running Apple. Um, source code for Linux guys, if you want to kind of, you know, mess around with it. Now, when you download it, uh, let me pull out the bin file. What you basically do is right click and open with the GW, uh, I hope I'm pronouncing that right, uh, package installer. If you just double click it, it'll try to unarchive it, you know, by itself. So, um, that's just you know just uh, something to let you guys know. Um, yeah, that's empty trash. So that's a review of the uh, the boxy kind of uh, media front end or media interface. Um, you know, so like I said, you can get a boxy box or you can go the route I'm going to go, which is you know this will be you know what I'll be thinking about when I'm building my my uh, system here in the next couple months. So just hey gonna have it be a full you know full Linux powered media you know dynamo so um, and I also I'm gonna be dual booting so I'll have it on my wind on the Windows side as well because I wouldn't mind running Netflix through it too I think that's fantastic why not have it be you know the the media center for it all um, so I just wanted to show you guys this and um, please rate comment uh, like it if you like uh, if you like it if you don't like it comment tell me why uh, if you got a, a video with some other features or something cool that you may have seen uh, definitely post up a video response like any and all video responses like I said uh, get approved I don't like to censor uh, thank you for watching and uh, I do hope that you do visit my channel again